Today is the annual weigh-in for the zoo, um, so we want to get as many weights on the animals that are here as possible. And what we want to do then is use the weights that we've got and we put them on something called ZIMS, which is a computer recording system that's shared all over the world. So you can compare weights from your animals to ones in America or in Europe. And you can also compare them with the ones in conservation projects abroad with wild animals as well, which is really handy. It's really important to have weights of animals in zoos um, so that we can keep an eye on their health. Captive animals sometimes can put on a little bit more weight just by being around people. People like to keep them happy, give them food. Um, we are very careful and selective on their diets. Um, we need to make sure they keep their weight down and that they're looking and finding their food um, in a similar way that they might do in the wild. So keeping an eye on their weight just make sure we're getting the diets right. Today, well, I've got the weights of the camels. Um, they've got weights um, of some of the reptile species, so quite a range of different animals. Some will be easier than others. And we can work in with our camels. Some of the keepers don't even work in with their animals and have to do it in a very different way. Yeah, you do have to be quite creative with some species. Um, yeah, with the camels, it was all about um, just taking our time. We actually introduced a little target stick, so he would touch the target and get the reward and then all of a sudden he was more focused on the target than the fact that he was stepping on the scale, so that worked quite well. And we had problems with our aardvarks weighing them because their tails was coming off the, the scales that we had and was giving us a false reading, so we had to change all the positioning of our scales and we actually changed the scales in the end. Um, so yeah, you have to really think out the box to get some weights on animals.